BMW, can I take your order, please? Hi, could I try one of the uh, one of the new Beyond Beef sausage and eggs, please? And an English muffin or a seeded bun? Uh, English muffin, please. And is there anything else? Oh, that's all, thank you. That's 520, drive through, please. Thank you. Can we get your pools in front? We'll bring it out when it's ready. Sure thing. Thank you. Sure, you are. Sorry about the wait. Thank you. Sure. Welcome back to another drive through edition of Ron Reviews. We're here at a w in Grand Falls, Windsor, Newfoundland. For a while now, a w has offered the Beyond Beef Burger, but as of today, March 11th, they're rolling out the brand new breakfast sandwich version. From a w it's the Beyond Beef Sausage and Agar. This literally just rolled out today. You guys are probably watching this on Tuesday, March 12th, one day into it. I think that's pretty good time. They've obviously had great success with the Beyond Beef Burger, and they have a very popular breakfast line here. So why not combine the two and appeal to the vegetarian audience? Bear in mind this is geared more towards like lacto-ovo vegetarians. Obviously the egg and the cheese. You, buy, you have both dairy and egg. But I guess you could get the English muffin and just the patty. Anyway guys, let's haul this out and take a look. There we have it. The Beyond Beef Sausage and Agar. Toasted English muffin, fried egg patty. And under that, we have the Beyond Beef Patty. And let's just take the top off and take a look at that sausage patty. And this is what the Beyond Beef Sausage Patty looks like. It looks pretty much exactly the same as the other. As I was saying, the Beyond Beef lineup here is pretty popular. I've tried the burger. While it tasted all right, it didn't necessarily have the texture of like a beef burger. And I really miss that. I'm interested to see how they take a spin on sausage. I found the other one was kind of like a sausage in a way. So I kind of have high hopes for this. Before this gets too cold, we're just going to bite in and dry it. The cheese, egg, sausage, and English muffin. I can't see it being that bad. Anyway guys, let's bite in and give it a try. First bite of the Beyond Beef Sausage and Agar, new from A&W. Here we go. Wow. Hmm. Guys, the English muffin here is great. I love the egg. I love the taste of the cheese. And believe it or not, this one tastes like a sausage. I do give it that. I want to take a bite of just the patty. I gotta say, that's pretty close to a sausage patty. The English muffin here is nice and fresh. That cheese and the egg, it's great. And the Beyond Beef patty, I'm very surprised by. While the patty itself could be a little bit more moist, it's not too bad. I've already heard a horror story about this where it was very dry, but mine actually seems all right. So guys over at Junk Food Junction, I think yours might've been a little overcooked. Mine's pretty enjoyable, gotta say. I can dig it. The patty here tastes like a sausage. It is seasoned nice. And I even get like that sausage greasiness. It seems pretty legit to me. And I was actually pretty harsh on the burger. I wasn't that big of a fan of it. But this I could roll with. What does Ron think at A&W's new Beyond Beef Sausage and Agar? Guys, it's solid. Ron's going to give this an 8.5 out of 10. I really wouldn't miss a sausage with this. If it was just a little bit more moist, it would definitely be just like over the top convincing. But as of right now, it is definitely great. This was a quick look at A&W's new Beyond Beef Sausage and Agar. This has been another drive-through edition of Ron Reviews and see you guys next time.